A delegation from the Cross-Party Taiwan Caucus at Indonesia's House of Representatives met with President Tsai Ing-wen, reports said Thursday, October 27. After Tsai was elected for a first term in 2016, she launched Taiwan's new southbound policy, targeting 18 nations, including Indonesia, for closer relations in a range of fields, from trade and investment to culture and education. The president noted that since the start of the policy, Taiwan and Indonesia have signed 20 memorandums of understanding. MOUs. Indonesia has also become the second largest source of foreign students in Taiwan, while more than 240,000 workers from the Southeast Asian nation are employed in the country. Bilateral trade reached 11.3 billion US dollars, 362.39 billion new Taiwan dollars, in 2021, she added. Tsai met delegation leaders Mardani Ali Sara of the Prosperous Justice Party PKS, his spouse Sidi Onia Warid, and Asep Maushal Afandi of the United Development Party PPP, Tuesday, October 25, CNA reported. The president said their visit was significant because it was the first from Indonesia's legislature since the start of the COVID-19 pandemic and because it featured members of different political parties. Both sides expressed the wish to deepen bilateral and international cooperation, with the Indonesian lawmakers voice the hope more students, fishermen, and farm workers could receive training in Taiwan to upgrade their skills.